Hi guys. So I'm gonna be eating this bowl of chocolate ice cream and watching Two Girls One Cup. Um, I don't really have sweet food very often. And I really like ice cream, so this is kind of a rare treat. Uh, I'm hoping it won't be too badly ruined by the experience of watching Two Girls One Cup. I haven't seen Two Girls One Cup since it originally came out. Uh, I was a small boy at the time. Someone sent it to me. Two Girls One Cup. Hey, what's this? Most of you watching this probably know what it is. quickly oh anyway it was interesting um it was kind of like two concurrent experiences i didn't feel like i was eating the shit it was just like oh that's horrible this is delicious that's horrible this is delicious the whole time it was just it was two separate things to be honest i felt it might you know but you can't avoid how disgusting the shit looks and you also can't avoid how nice the ice cream tastes Really, for me, the problem wasn't Two Girls, One Cup. It was eating the ice cream in such a hurry. Two Girls, One Cup didn't really affect the ice cream eating experience. If I could have taken my time and sat there, I would have thought I'd rather watch something else, you know, obviously. Put an episode of Dragon's Den on or The Simpsons. But still, like, I could do it. I would still be like, I'd rather watch this and have the ice cream than not have the ice cream. So, yeah, you know, in the end, not too bad, apart from the brain freeze. Ray right out of ten. The whole thing. The whole experience out of 10. Well, the ice cream was a good seven or eight. It was a shame, really, that I had, you know, but a two girls, one cup. Um, I mean, it depends how you look at it, you know, if it's like for comedic value, it's not that low, but at, so it's quite hard to rate two girls, one cup, to be honest. Um, I'm going to say it's a three out of 10. Uh, it's the best I can come up with, so you put those together. What do you get? Three out of ten seems quite high for two girls. Well, I'm basing it on the fact that it You're bought me some freak. level of amusement. It's an iconic <laughs> video. <laughs> that's some you need Three out of ten. No, that's not three a, out of ten. Not you really need to do some deep, dark, soul searching. If I said five out of ten, I'd be a psychopath. Three out of ten is completely. Three out of ten is really twisted. I'm saying it has some obvious value. Otherwise, why are we watching it? Hmm. Hmm. Mm hmm. 